This week, apparently a lot of you were having tough weekends, so I'm so glad I decided to post a video of Vanna that was just put out, as luck would have it, to help brighten weekends. Eric Faith is up here as a representation of everyone who stopped in to tell me how much better she had made their weekend. Good morning, pig pugs. Good morning, pig pugs. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, pig pugs. Did you know it is National Pets Week? I did not know until this morning, and I am so glad I found out because it is perfect timing for me to share some exciting news with you. This beautiful little lady is Mabel and effective immediately. In fact, infective negative immediately. She is now a member of Pigtopia. You're gonna see Mabel wearing some socks. I am normally not a proponent of guinea pigs wearing clothes. However, in this case, it was only fair because she was meeting new piggies and the other piggies had fur. And when piggies meet, it's not always the nicest thing. So I wanted to make sure that she had a fair fight and stood a chance of fitting in. Mabel is the sweetest little girl and a definite cuddle pig. I think you guys are gonna fall in love with her just as fast as I did. As you know, introducing a new piggy is not an easy thing, and I would be lying if I said this was the extent of the introduction process, but it definitely was not. This was a rough one, guys, and I don't want to stress you out. I was stressed out enough for all of us, so I will just give you really fast the highlights. Here we go. All right, Queen Bee's coming in. We've got a little dragon in her. <whistles> Princess, I think this is good for you, boo. You were getting a little big for your britches. What do you smell, Fuzzy? I like how Masha is giving Dobby a sock. She's moving kind of funny in it, but I figure it's better than the alternative. I mean, she wears it well. Looks good on her. What do you think, Fozzie? Does it need rearranging? So yeah, at this point we have two herds. Princess and Mabel are hanging out together, and then the old timers, Fiddy, Nori, and Fozzy, are all hanging out together. We're keeping them where they can smell each other and talk through bars. We may try to integrate more over time, but for now, it is better to keep them separate, especially with Mabel not having fur. Hi. Oh, they got you good, huh? You're gonna be okay. being silly. What do you think? We are hoping for the best and we hope you have the best. Keep us in your thoughts and piggy prayers. That way maybe we can go back to having one herd. Obviously we're going to make what's the best choice for all of the pigs involved and us as well. Give us your tips and tricks in the comments and in the meantime be cute. We'll see you next time. Bye.